That, my friends, is an external hard drive that plugs into your PCMCIA port. Say it with me now, PCMCIA. Raise your hand if you remember. So one of the consequences of shooting this Hack Across the Planet vlog the way that it's naturally evolved is such that I'm running out of disk space. Oh, it is echoey in here. Check that out. Not a single four or a 13. What happened to 13 and 14? Manga do them all. Seems to be the place to go. Alright, my mission is to find an external hard drive because I did not bring enough disk space for this trip and I'm kicking myself for not. Oh well. Uh, and see if I can figure out a wide angle lens situation for this and a little Bluetooth adapter and some other odds and ends. Ah, uh, I ever mentioned that the Wi-Fi pineapple is featured in that game? I may have mentioned that like once or twice. I honestly can't recall the last time I saw so much software in person. There's Hupical Media, who has a CD-ROM drive. Well, at least they did a good Photoshop job on the Photoshop case. I sort of want to pick up a copy of Adobe Photoshop 7 just to run it through some malware analysis. Hey Shannon, do we need any uh, stock video for the show? Because this is hours and hours of it and it's only a hundred thousand rupiah, which is like seven dollars. Or how about vector graphics? I mean, that's like $3,800 worth of savings right there. I don't need a seven inch dual sim phablet, but I want one. Hashtag technolust. If you have a great idea, bring it to the web the way Shannon and I do and head over to domain.com. With an awesome domain discovery service and a quick and easy checkout process, you'll have the perfect site up and running in no time. And the guys over at domain.com are huge Hack5 fans, which is why HAK5 will save you an extra 20% at domain.com. Or just send them a tweet and say thanks for supporting Hack5 all these years. So, when you think domain names, think domain.com. Have I mentioned how I want a 7 inch phone but don't need one whatsoever? iPhone.
Well, I came looking for that quintessential Asian electronics flea market experience, and I received just that. I also got asked for a lot of selfies. 